Hmm. What do you guys think about this filter that's on the camera right now? Let me let me take it off so you can see what it's like without it for reference. Okay, that's no filter now. And this is with it. What do you guys think? Kind of it diffuses the lights a little bit in the back. Hmm. We're gonna keep it on for this episode. Welcome back to the channel. Today we're gonna be watching What If episodes three and four, maybe five, if I have enough storage on my memory card after the uh, three and four. You know, I. I'm gonna check how much storage I have. I have about 33 gigabytes, which should be enough for two episodes. If it's enough for three, then I'll definitely do it. But in the last two episodes, we basically got to see what if Peggy Carter became Captain Carter, the first Avenger, and what if T'Challa became Star-Lord, which were actually two very interesting episodes. I did enjoy the uh, T'Challa the episode a little bit more than the first Avenger one, just because I like Chadwick Boseman a lot so it's like yeah naturally i'm just gonna enjoy that more so but anyway this episode we're gonna watch what if the world lost its mightiest heroes what so if stanos win or something they just get waxed or what like when he snaps they die too or something like that i don't know so anyways i'm gonna stop wasting time we're just gonna hop right into this episode if you'd like to watch the full length reaction that will be available on patreon as well early access to the next two episodes of what if will also be available on patreon so Let's get started. To bring together a group of remarkable, of remarkable soul oh shit, something. something more, something we couldn't add, something like that out of the uh, Infinity War trailer. The Avengers initiative on that. On Tony, uh, as Iron Man 2, when like, he had his midlife crisis. I remember you do everything yourself at working out for me. I've been worse. You become a problem. And slowly killing him right there. Get it. Hit him. God. What'd she just do to me? What did nope. we just It's not a cure. It just abates the symptoms. Oh, is this what kills him? Okay. Oh shit. She accidentally just killed him. Yeah. Damn. It wasn't lithium dioxide, it was actually fentanyl. Just gave him rat poison. I may not have been a fan of Tony Stark, but I didn't kill him. This wasn't me. I know that. But you know these won't hold me. Oh, I'm counting on it. Healed. Compromised Stark's antidote. Ooh. I need someone on the outside to find out who. Sure, big swing on me, boss. Safest bet I'll ever make. Hell yeah. She's the most reliable. Yeah, so someone set her up, I guess. It's probably the fools in the van with her, Hydra, because these are all ops. They all work for Hydra, so. Someone who's. Oh, it's probably the one dude who's working for Hydra. In uh, Winter Soldier, I forget his name, but I'm pretty sure Nick Fury shot him in Winter Soldier. I want to say his name was like Pierce or something. I don't know. He's a Caucasian male, mid twenties, with. Okay, why? Okay, wait. How is he just waxing everyone so easily? I thought when he was sent to Earth, he was just a mere man. Gorgeous. I like, need uh, eyes in the sky. Bart I thought like he technically lost like. I mean, I guess he's still the same. You know, he just can't pick up the hammer now. Hold your fire. I want to see this. I mean, yeah, he still put in work when he uh, came in here in the movie. Hold your. Oh. oh. I told you to stand down. I did. No, the th the thunder went off at the same time he did it. Damn. But yeah, he just. Your arrow would indicate otherwise. Well, the thunder went off as soon as like. He let go of it, so something happened. It's probably fucking Loki doing some shit. <laughs> All right, well Thor's dead now, so. Yeah, won't talk to anyone. He'll talk to me. Yeah, Nick Fury knows. He didn't do it. Wake up, Sleeping Beauty. Bart. Oh, is he dead? Oh, he's dead. Stay with me. All right, I'm gonna say it's Loki doing this. Like it has to be. He's on the same someone who killed Stark. Unless you have any ideas. There was an idea. Hmm. There was an idea. <laughs> Wednesday. Dr. Ross. Not sure if you remember hmm. me, but... Oh, that's, uh, that's Bruce Banner's girlfriend. Shield came poking around. I haven't... Is Dr. Bruce Banner. I've seen the first Hulk movie, like, with, um... What's his, what's his name? 
with Ed, Ed Norton, right? With that, I've seen that one. So like, I know that's his girlfriend, and like, mm -hmm. she's the daughter of Ross, who's the military guy. Come here. I need to keep this off Shield's radar. Then we gotta check on the green guy. Then what killed him? Whatever it was, it wasn't biological. Your antidote didn't mm. even make it out of the syringe. It looks mm. to me like I'm a biologist, not mm. a ballistics expert, and I believe we're done here. Oh, okay. <laughs> Don't know where that attitude just came from out of nowhere. Martin's dead. Oh, yeah, that hurts her so much. Who do I kill? Mm. <laughs> Funny thing, boss. I think I already have. <laughs> I Was his dead body about to be in here? Move, or I'll make you move. No need to. Oh. We oh. need to go. Yeah, I hear, I hear the helicopter. Okay. What the? What the fuck? It's Loki. Loki's pulling up right now. Oh, if it's Hela. Nah, she's still in the inner world. It's coming from Asgard because it has to buy Frost, but so I'm saying it's Loki. Oh, no. That is Loki, but he came with a goddamn army. Oh, shit. What, because Thor died or something? Is that why he's pulling up? All right, well, I guess so that rules out Loki. He's the killer. Who the hell could it be? Looking for directions, sir? Because you seem to have lost your way. That's everyone from Asgard. You would do best to kneel before a god. <laughs> Crown Prince of Asgard. The rightful king of Jotun... Hello. <laughs> Jotunheim and God you gonna, of Ma You gotta answer that? It's safer for everyone if I fend for myself. I sort of can't die. Then I yeah. guess you're in love. Oh yeah. Just like in his own movie. Is this abomination dude gonna be in here? I'm a little busy here, Widow. No good. We'll start a support group. <laughs> that, that brought you here, Mr. Loki. Vengeance! This planet murdered Thor Odin's son, the Crown Prince of Asgard. Okay, yeah, that's why he's here. Agent of S.H.I.E.L.D., I have Bruce Banner in my custody. You need to stand down. No, they're gonna kill him! <gasps> oh... Wouldn't he just turn into the Hulk right there? Like, right before Bruce dies, wouldn't he just turn into the Hulk or something? Or, like, as soon as he's shot, wouldn't he just turn into the Hulk? I don't know. Uh... Cause it's like when he fell out of the helicopter or whatever in the original, in the original Hulk movie, he turned to the Hulk before he hit the ground. Not really in Ragnarok, but in the, this movie he did. So it's like right before, you know. And he said he shot himself in the mouth with a gun, and then he, the other guy spit it out. I mean, he, he did turn into the Hulk, but that was, I felt that felt kind of delayed, honestly. I'm, I'm actually really curious to see how they're gonna kill the Hulk right here, like whoever it is. Yes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Who did? <laughs> what the? He's just gonna. He's a balloon. He's just gonna explode. <gasps> oh, that's tough. That's so tough. But he can't die. Oh, he just did. <laughs> All right, I'm taking this filter off. I don't think it looks good. When I find your brother's killer, you will have your pound of flesh. Yeah, you're probably the only one able to kill him. Kill whoever it is. Why not? Because I'm not. Coulson. Coulson, just do it. I feel like it's someone from Hydra. That's like the only other kind of person it could be. That's the only other like villain it could be, I think. Unless I'm forgetting someone. I got like it's not Ultron because and, like Tony hasn't created him yet. He died before he could, so. Huh. How did a woman who died two years ago access the dead? Hmm. You won't win. Not against me. The fuck are you? It's Ant-Man. It has to be. They're not invisible. They're just so tiny. We can't see them. It literally has to be Ant-Man. Because no one else in the MCU is invisible. Because there's no one that's invisible in the MCU. It's all about hope. Mm. It has to be Ant-Man. Because he's so small, he's practically invisible. And strong enough to throw her around like that. Maybe she, but she did say like, someone, a lady who died two years ago. How she accessed the files yesterday. So who the hell was, who the hell died two years ago? Hope, Ant Man's girlfriend. Hmm. Nah. Couple individuals to fight the battles we can't. I wrote the speech. 
you cap oh I'm not the only Avenger left yeah what about cap oh he's calling Captain Marvel it's all about hope oh it has to be Ant Man's girlfriend it's a girl that she was talking about but she didn't die so it's like I don't know you got a name soldier That's the buddy that Loki sent in Thor 1. Alright, Thursday. I feel, yeah, I feel like we should work with Loki, if anything. San Fran, California. Hope Van Dyne. Oh, wow. It isn't Hank Pym. Oh, wait, so it's Hank Pym is the fucking killer? She died because of you. Oh, Agent fuck. Agent Hope Van Dyne was killed on a... How, how'd she die the same way her mother did? Okay, so, yeah... So, okay, Hope obviously doesn't die. Yep, here she is. But I guess in this timeline, she did. So that's why Hank's going fucking crazy right now. But I know it's what if, so it's possible. But I thought they would have showed us that if they decided to change that. I don't know. I was close. I was close. Yours will be a triumph. <laughs> yeah, that easy. Just swat him. Bro, does Nick Fury have the fucking super serum? <laughs> that, is it projection? Oh, it's Loki. It's Loki. That's why. Okay, he's working with Loki. Okay, duh. That's why he was able to just whack. That's why he's able to just fight him so easily. Duh. I was wondering when Loki's gonna pull up, you know, but he, already, he was here the entire time. <laughs> yep. mm -hmm. To save the world from men like you. Oh, got your ass. Damn, that's so sad. I really liked Hank in the movies. And she will never be forgotten. And when you honor her. Damn. That's so sad to see him have this downfall. It was an absolute pleasure, Director Fury. Good. Now take your hammer and get off my planet. No, he's, he's going to take over. Yeah. The allies. You know, I just had an idea. Oh, I just got an idea. Surrender to me forever. Pride that I stand before you today to announce that in just one... I am your dictator. And united under my command. Mm. The bright view of freedom hobbles you. Diminishes your life. That's what he said in uh, his show, Loki. Your destiny. Jesus. Oh, well, now we gotta take out Loki. I don't know how. On the bigger picture. Oh, okay. Well, he didn't... Back, Captain. Oh, okay. I got the the movies mixed up. Then I thought. Oh, you're a little bit late. All right. Okay. I thought Cap was already founded found by then. Okay. I thought he, okay, well, that's the end of the episode. Okay, so I had a little bit mixed up, yeah. I thought Cap was already, like, a, like awake by then and stuff, so, oopsie. I don't know, like, honestly, all the movies just feel so mixed together. Like, they're just, they all just blend together. I have, like, okay, the major events, I get. All the early Phase 1 movies and Phase 2, it's all just mixed together for me, so, oopsie. <laughs> like, when Coulson said they all, they fell before they had a chance to rise, I was like, wait, didn't the first Avengers movie already happen? But nah. All right, that was a pretty solid episode. Very, I think that was the most interesting episode so far, honestly, because it was like, how how did the Avengers die? You know, how how did they get taken out? And yeah, they kind of just added a detail without telling us, you know, until they revealed who the killer was. That's that's cool. I mean, I guess that means like they can just change it without having to tell us, you know. I thought if they're like everything they were gonna change, they were gonna show us, but I guess not. So. Okay. All right. On to the next episode. It's like, what if Doctor Strange lost his heart instead of his hands? Ooh. Okay. Dirt. You promised me creme brulee. Okay. Let's see how well I remember Doctor Strange. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, fellow doctors. <sighs> no. No. Stop. Well, yeah. In the movie, he didn't bring her in the in this car ride. In the did he? Because like he he crashed by himself. Pretty sure he blew her off in the movie. But now she went with him. Okay. And he, he crashed by... He crashed because he was texting and driving like a dummy. And now he's going to crash by... Because he was staring in her eyes. Or something like that. <gasps> Ooh. 
Mm. Ooh, ooh, that was close. You're okay. Oh. Fuck. Damn. Oh, no. Yep. No, no. Instead of his hands, she died. Damn. In this universe, Stephen Strange didn't lose his hands, but his heart. Fuck. Grief stricken, Strange sought answers across the world and in the mystic arts. Okay, that's still interesting. He came to the mystic arts. He only came here to fix. He came here originally to fix his hands because he met that one dude who was paralyzed. Right and now, he's able to walk and play basketball and all that stuff. And so he met with that guy and he told him to go here. And so how would he come here if he never broke his hands, you know? Okay. Oh, she died. The Sorcerer Supreme. Dormammu, I've come mm -hmm. to bargain. Could not let go of the past. Sorry, but this is now. Oh, well, yeah, he literally has the fucking time shown. And so he can just go back in time. I mean, if he, I don't know if he can go that far back in time. I'm pretty sure it's like he can only do moments. Like, I don't think he can, he can jump back like two five years. years. Oh, it's been two years. Like in Infinity War, when Thanos rewinded the time to bring Vision back to life, when he did that, did he reset time like, I don't know, 10 seconds for the entire world and universe? Or was it just Vision and that explosion and everything in that area being reset and everything else never reset? If, does that make sense? I hope that makes sense. Please let me know. And it was like with Dormammu, he was just going back in time as soon as Dormammu killed him. You know, it's like, oh, so as far as I know, it's just been brief moments. Oh, fuck. I guess he can go back in time this far, two years, so. No, you said it. You have to do it now. Only if you're by my side. Wait a sec. Have you? Yeah, don't drive like a dummy now. But that, you get rear ended hella bad, so. Oh, you know what? You know what? Just wait an extra five minutes to leave. So this car that rear ends you is ahead of you by the time you get on this part of the road. Oh, we missed our turn. Isn't the place hmm. that way? Taking Fuck. a different route. Yeah, hell no, we're not going there. <gasps> Fuck. You know, bro, it really seems like you're not supposed to... No, this is not supposed to happen. <laughs> I feel like she's just gonna die every single time. Okay. We'll go, we'll dance. I promise you we will have a good <sighs> No. Oh no, oh no. Oh, pizza. You're a genius. Hope oh, robbery. Wow. Yeah, bro, she's not meant to live. She's gonna die every time no matter what. Like the TVA is gonna make sure she dies, okay? You're causing so many Nexus events right now. Why does this keep happening? Aren't we allowed to be happy? Oh. Hey, are you okay? Do you want to talk? Mm. You're just going to get rear-ended again. You're back on that road. Yeah, the car right there behind you. Well, maybe he's in the passenger now. Nope, she still died and he didn't. Okay. I mean, yeah, I'd rather lose my hands than lose her, so... But he doesn't know that other reality where he loses his hands instead, because I never, because he never did this by himself. Take hearts hmm. in me. Help me bring her back. No, because she never dies. You never become Doctor Strange. So. Her death is an absolute point in time, unchangeable, unmovable. Mm. Never have defeated Dormammu and mm -hmm. become the Sorcerer Supreme. Damn, that's so sad. That's so sad death you never start your journey mm. you cannot reverse an absolute point no books have been lost libraries destroyed stop torturing yourself Stephen. Mm -hmm. there is no hope here don't be a prisoner in your mind please do not do this or i will be forced to stop you Sorry. Damn, so what, he turns evil now because he's so desperate to save her? It's like Anakin, bro. <laughs> hey, hey, I'm talking here. Where are you going? Follow him, dummy. 
Bro, you're just trying so hard to get the TV to come to you, bro. <laughs> <laughs> you have to be the strangest dress sorcerer I've ever seen. Uh, <clears throat> yeah, it... No pun intended. According to legend, he knew how to break an absolute point in time. Hmm. Where... Maybe here. Maybe there. Maybe nowhere. Is this him? Mm. Wonderful. I feel like this is him. Please tell me you're not Cagliostro. <laughs> the name's Obang. Oh. Aha. Gain the power through the absorption of other beings. Oh no, he's gonna have to kill to get more powerful. Oh, what the hell? Whoa. Uh, <clears throat> is this the squid from episode one of What If? I don't know, probably not. What happened? You lost. You got waxed. Do not bargain. Their powers are not meant for man. Yeah, you're just gonna have to kill him and take the power if you can't somehow. Is she worth the pain? Yes. Every moment of it. There is a fine line between devotion. <gasps> no, my light. Then break more than your heart. It can shatter your mind. Yes, it can. That's facts. Just look at Anakin Skywalker, dude. <laughs> no book, Armani. Life taught me. This guy is very wise. If they won't surrender their power, I'll take it. Ah, it's turning evil. Ah, oh, RP Garden Gnome. <sighs> oh no. More. He's looking more and more evil. He's on the wrong path. Mm -hmm. I could warn the universe is not worth risking the safety of all others. Mm -hmm. Besides, I doubt he'd listen. Oh, hell no. He's delusional right now. Hello? Oh. He heard us? He heard us! Damn. He's literally just spawn killing everyone. Oh, shit. Okay. Time, sorcerer Armani. <laughs> Damn, RIP already. Put that away. No, you can't. I chose to live. But I can reverse this. You will live. He doesn't want to live longer. Mm -hmm. I can't accept that. <laughs> He's obsessed with stopping death. Strange will. Mm. Other. Yeah, what do you mean other? You're only half a man. Mm. Living half a life. Some deep shit right there. Like a different version of him not decide to not do it. Yep. For one evening. Yep. Okay, that's interesting. Oh, sh what was in that whiskey? <laughs> oh, Agent One. I need your help to destroy Evil Strange. But I fear we don't have much time. Then who's causing this? You. Well, you are. Yep. How? When it's trying to milk everything for all the for the most power. Mention to split the timeline, to split mm. you. I'm looking for the last. Okay. Things to occur in one universe. Two timelines. Damn. I okay. doubt that's the simplest or smallest. It's not confusing at all. If the other strange succeeds in reversing an absolute point in our universe, we're dead. The resulting temporal paradox will destroy this universe. You want to stop him? Weren't you in love with this crystal? <sighs> yes, but no. I have to do it for the greater good. How would you find him? It's gonna be alright. He's right here. Where am I? The question is... When are you? Oh yeah? Why are you? If you know, you know. We loved her. You can't bring her back. You can't. The world out there is breaking. Don't you dare lie! Bro, just move on! <laughs> nah. He is torn for her, dude. He is so powerful now, though. And now can you save her? No, Steven. Not yet, but I need you. Can. Dude, it's so it would be so tempting to, you know? But... You literally can't. Dean, we destroy the world. Mm -hmm. I told you, she doesn't understand. We love Chris. No, if you save her, there's no world to live in with her. Like, bro, this is extremely selfish of you. It's what drove us to study the mystic arts in the first place. 
Like, bro, you're literally Anakin Skywalker. The world, however, still stands a chance. Bro, she wouldn't even want to be with you if you're gonna be like this too. You're not the man I fell in love with, you know? That's what she'll- that's what she'd say. I don't even think they were in love. Like, they liked each other for sure, but I don't even know if you can say they were in love. Too far to turn back now. Damn. You got lost in the sauce. It's so trippy to see him fight himself. <laughs> Christine. It's an illusion. It's trying to bait you into doing it. I know. We can be together again. No, you can't. Steven, I love you. Yeah, think of everyone on Earth, dude. Think about it. I wish that was true, but you're... You're not her. Mm. Yep. No. Take the spell away. And try and take all his power. Fuck. Damn, so Evil Strange won. So now he's powerful enough. It's me. Oh god, it's not even him, bro. Yeah, she's like, she's like, I don't know you, bro. I brought you back. I saved you. No, no this bro. is this. This isn't real. This is. The... Yeah, she's not. She's gonna be terrified of you, bro. Think she wants to kiss that? Oh, I can fix this. No, bro. <laughs> and the world's gonna be destroyed anyway. Christine. Oh, oh, he looks normal now. Supposed to happen. Bro, the ancient one tried to tell you, but you did not believe her. What is going on? No! Can he save the world, though? Is he strong enough? Nope. You! You could stop this! Please! Oh, he sees him. The world shouldn't pay for my arrogance. I read about you, sensed your presence. Hmm. God, you can undo this. I'm not a god. I'm just a watcher. Honestly, if I could fix this, if I could punish you instead, I would. Oh. But I can't. Dealing with time and events only leads to more destruction. Yeah, if anyone should know that, it should be you, bro. His own selfishness got in his way. He's thinking emotionally, not logically. Oh, they're still alive in this bubble. Oh, she dies anyway. Yep. What did you do? Damn, bro. See what you did? No, 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 no. You lost her anyway. You had her back for another 10 minutes and you lost her again. I am so, so sorry. Aw. Oh, it's such a sad story, dude. Destroy the entire universe. Mm hmm. Damn, all right. Well, that was episode four. Shit. All right, so that was What If, episode three and four. I think these two episodes are probably the most interesting so far because it's like, well, what if the Avengers died? You know, and it's like, well, that's how that's really tough. <sighs> you know, that was a really good twist by making Hank Pym the one who killed them. And you know, it's like, yeah, this in this timeline, Hope died, right? She died somehow by Shield's fault, right? His daughter, okay? And obviously in the regular timeline we saw, like she obviously doesn't die, but you know, I kind of assumed that like if anything is gonna be different, they're gonna show us and tell us that, but nope, they didn't. So I mean that would kind of give away the twist, honestly, too. So Okay, I get it, I get it, I get it. All right, so stuff could happen off screen too. Okay, okay, interesting. And then with Doctor Strange, it's just like goes to show you like how desperate somebody is for the ones that they love. You know, they're willing to do anything to get them back. They're willing to do anything to save them. I've seen that story before in a different franchise. It didn't work out so well. Very easily manipulated when you're that vulnerable to get, you know and that desperate to get them back so yeah willing to do anything and honestly it's kind of selfish if you think about it like he was willing to just risk destroying the entire world just for her you know and it's like the angel one tried to warn him but he was so delusional at that point 
and so desperate to get her back it's like he doesn't give a fuck you know he probably like he probably was like yeah sure whatever like he probably didn't even believe her but she was right so but yeah that was what if episodes three and four comment down below what you thought about these episodes down below in the comments and if you like the video like the video and thanks for watching